WTFNN. Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here on this 20th day of May. My pleasure to be here. And uh, we're looking at a very interesting market. Yesterday, late afternoon, I remember when we did the update at noon, I was saying that we were anticipating some kind of a pullback later in the day into a Wednesday morning. Never expected what we saw. Just kind of bad news on the Moderna uh, front. That was the virus, anti antivirus uh, that's been worked on. And uh, market uh, took, its, took a big breather. Now we're back. We're up $400 at 24,615. But for the Dow, there's this tremendous resistance in the 24,700s. We need to see the Dow, the 24,820 area by Friday. I think that's really important. You don't want to see it pull back too sharply. But look at this the SP, and the Dow has failed to make a leg C so far in the weekly chart, but the S&P has done that. Very strong leg C. Doesn't have to close as long as it gets there and it's done that. I'm calling this a leg B for the moment. I don't see any other account in the in the daily chart of the S&P. And that suggests you couldn't get a top until maybe early next week. And there'll have to be a, a really big plunge under the gap high of the 18th, which was at 29.13.86. Uh, you start going below that, that would be quite serious if it's in this very short term period. The QQQs lead the way as, as they have since the March 23rd low. And that says that the index 100, um, this is very interesting. The Qs are at 231.52, all time high is 237.47, just six points away. In other words, if you were long and you went into the high of February, <clears throat> Where it hit 237.47, and then you just kind of like Ruff and Wrinkle, you just kind of fell asleep for a couple of weeks, right? And you woke up and you said, Oh, what a pity, my, my Qs are down six points. Oh, six points. It's like, it's like 3%, 2, 3%. Um, huh. And then you look at the chart and say, But wait a minute, it went down to 164, and now it's back. That is incredible strength, and it's talking to the leadership of the whole technology area. The modern day, the, the accoutrements that fit exactly with what's needed. Let's just quickly look at the IWM, and then I'll do more of this in my show, The Tiger Technicians Out of This Leg. Yeah, this is a good leg, but it hasn't made a new recovery high by over 136. And gold continues to do very nicely here. It's up five, it's stuck in that higher range. It's holding very well. I'll be back, we'll talk a lot more about it in my Tiger Technicians Hour coming up in a few minutes. Hope you can stay, hope you'll be there. Otherwise, I'll see you tomorrow. Have a great day.